What should I do? We're going to get your bag up from the aircraft. And, and what should I do? We where am be, I going? We won't be accepting you. You can't throw things at people. Well, when we're I don't throw you... it. I'm, I'm in a hurry. No, no, no. You throw it. We, we can't, can't accept you with that carry-on. I can't believe this. Definitely not. <coughs> really, that's not possible. That's not possible. No, no, no. I can't. We, we tried. We've explained. <laughs> Okay, so about two weeks ago, I uploaded a video of some of my favourite Airline UK clips and within days it hit 1 million views. I made a second version with a voiceover to replace the text-to-speech commentary and there were so many nice comments saying do another one that I decided to do exactly that for this video. This next clip was actually featured for a few seconds in the first video, but the squeaky mouse lady is such an Airline UK icon. I thought I'd show you guys what happened once she brought the frequency down. Oh, no, really, you can't get on that floor. Oh, no! Michelle Salinger has arrived 15 minutes late for the morning flight to Barcelona. Uh, I'm interviewing a whole load of teachers on the next and one? At, at, at a college, and then I'm going to a university to interview teachers as well. And then I've, I let them down last time because I, because of the September 11th thing. They're all set up for me to see them, and I let them down at the last minute. And I, you know, I can't let these guys down. They've given up their time for me. They've rescheduled all their classes for me. She's desperate to be allowed on the flight, but it's not looking good. No, 7.20. Oh, no, sorry. I've got to get on. The flight's on time. Let me just check. Oh, please. Please. I've got my appointments. I've got 20 people waiting to be interviewed by me. Oh, please don't do this to me. No, there isn't, honestly. Oh, God, what am I going to do? You've got no idea. Oh, my God, these guys. Can you just confirm the Barcelona's on time? Michelle's pleading wins her one last chance. OK, thank you. Bye-bye. Yeah, he's definitely on time. Oh, no, please. Let's be able to get through. But she's out of luck. The next one is at five past one. That's so good. I've got to beat them before. Oh, you can't get you on the 7.20 now. Oh, God. <laughs> the next Barcelona flight won't even leave until after Michelle should have arrived. It's not one of her better mornings. <laughs> I could have got that flight. They let me go at five miles. Well, you should have arrived on time. You don't even know how to fly. What an idiot. With little real choice, Michelle agrees to take the later flight. I just feel sick. At Luton, passenger patience is running out fast, and the news isn't getting any better. We've just been told that the Barcelona flight's just been cancelled now as well. And these guys have been waiting here since about one in the afternoon. It's now nine o'clock. This has got to be the worst day that I've ever had here. Crazy. Leo's actually such a champion, isn't it? Yeah. Like, how many series have gone by in every episode? He deals with people so well. Yeah. OK, passengers travelling to Barcelona, there are no more seats until the 1st of January. Oh, God, here we go again. Good luck, Leo. <laughs> <laughs> that is clean. I have to be in Barcelona tonight. I if it's not tonight, to tonight, we don't care. We have to be in Barcelona. Can you let me know whether you'll be refunding the transfers, the other end, and the hotel? I can't say that. Going for I can't. Why can't you say that? Because I don't have that information Forget to give. It. We don't have that information well, what do to give. You don't have it. Someone's got it. No, there's a complaint procedure in place. I'll what we're recommending. Procedure, mate. What we want to get to Barcelona what, tonight. What we're recommending is you keep your receipts and writing. That's the complaint procedure. Keep your receipt and writing right into it. To our customer Steve support. Stelios, that print. To our customer support that unit. Steve Lios. Okay. You've cut that pride out deliberately. I've checked Gatwick and Stansted and now well, all his destination. No he's good to me. I got the money to get there. There's children around. Can you just yeah, please I'm sorry. Well, I got the money to get there, mate. 
OK, you need to tone the language down. OK, well, where are you going to get me a Barcelona before tomorrow? I can't. Why not? Because there are no more services. Why not? There's no seats. Why not? There's no seats. Why not? There's no more seats. Why not? Good luck. There's not an answer. <laughs> there are. It's not Sorry. good enough, mate. It's not good enough. Why, 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 yeah? Please, Sorry? please, Because people who are tomorrow, <laughs> and they have to be tomorrow in Barcelona. So, well, it's is your responsibility to find a flight for us. Excuse me, what's that? Is that an agreement with you? Yes. Right. Are you going to honour it? I'm, oh, it's I'm an agreement. Trying to help. I'm trying to no, help you're not. You. You're just saying you've all got I'm, nothing. All I'm doing is passing the information. So yeah, what I've information? You've got nothing. I've got an agreement with you, hours, and you've broken it. Okay. Yeah, you've broken it. What's you going to do about it? I'm acting as a representative. Yeah, on you're doing great. Right. All you're saying is you've got nothing. I've okay. got an agreement in front of me. I'm to quit. Okay. Well, where is it? If Getting you, angry at me it. is not going to help the situation. Sorry. At all. I can't. I can't pull planes. Well, what's out the point of you sir? sitting there and doing nothing then? I'm trying to transfer people. Does anybody want to be transferred for the first of January? Lots of seats. Well, that's a lot of oh, good yes. after New Year's Eve, isn't it? Can you you stupid bird. Just give me a reason. Is it because it's, people? It was due can't to. Work? It was due to weather. It no. Was due well, to now, I know he's been told he can't fly to Barcelona for New Year's Eve because of extreme weather, but to still want to fly out and risk his life to get there, this man must either absolutely love the sesh or Tony Soprano is hosting a mob meeting and Don Corleone's told him he can't be late. <laughs> and then I do not forgive. Exactly, mate. What do I do now? My hands are tied. No, they're not tied, mate. I've you got to sleep tonight. There's nothing else I've got to sleep. I've got to sleep, mate. Okay. Okay, well, what are you going to do about it? I can't it? do anything here Why for not? you because I've got nothing that I can do. Well, what's the point of you bleeding coming down then? Okay. Oh, like, you are a waste of time. Got some flights to Malaga oh, tomorrow. Oh, fantastic. Malaga. Any other place? Oh. Girona? Yeah, it's Malaga. Girona, Madrid. I mean, Malaga is Malaga far, Barcelona? far south. What about Girona? Girona. Oh. Girona. They're telling us there is no stop anywhere in this country of EasyJet to get us little crowd to Barcelona for a New Year's Eve celebration. Adios, amigo. Correct. Mr Williams, along with most of the Barcelona passengers, opts to transfer to the next day's Madrid flight. Back in the airport, the check-in desk is as close to a plane as some people ever get. I can't... I can't get anybody else onto it now. When's the next one? Uh, not another one till 9.40 now. And, and we oh, have to close on. the flights at 30 minutes before. There's, oh, come there's no on, leeway around please. it. Please. I can't. I wish we could. I know you've noticed that I haven't boarded, but even then, we can't get anybody but else on it. I can just it. run up there. There's no luggage. It's not. Luggage. It's not a case of, of just running. Oh, we can't. Come on. I'm sorry. You can't make me wait two hours here. Please, you really I'll just can't. Double check can't. with dispatch. Please. What is it? Is it a meeting? It's a really important meeting. What you don't get up at five thirty for nothing. A seasoned traveller, Lucy Daniels has arrived late at check-in for her flight to Glasgow. Well, I'm five minutes after the gates closed. I've got no check-in and they won't let me on the flight. All right, mate, cheers. Bye. We can't. Unbelievable. Sorry. It's not good enough, you know. It really isn't good enough. I hate how these people turn up too late and then act like it's the airline's fault. But you can see them deep down slowly realising who's really to blame. It's not your fault. I know. It's not your fault. I know. No, no, you don't. It's not your fault. <laughs> it's pathetic. I mean, can I just not go to the gate now? No, you can't. Because the flight is shut now, we, we've got to have a cut-off point. We can't keep accepting, accepting people. But it's, five, it's like under five minutes. No, we can't keep accepting people, or else we'd never get away. there's nobody else waiting. I'm if sorry. there were ten people waiting, I'd understand I'm it. Sorry, we can't. I've checked with dispatch. You check so with Am the I definitely on the next flight? Yes, at 9.40. So what do I do? Just check in at 7.40 for the 9.40 flight. All right, guys, that's it for today. When I made this video, I actually had enough clips for a 20 minute video. So if you guys like this again, let me know in the comments or leave a like and I'll do another one. Thank you for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it and see you again next time. Adios, amigo. Correct.